In this video, I'm going to teach you how to enable virtualization in Windows 10 Lenovo ThinkPad. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Regardless of which model of ThinkPad you have, you will be able to enable or disable virtualization accordingly. And this will work for both Windows 11 and Windows 10. So, to start, you have to go into the BIOS. There are various different ways to access the BIOS, but the one that I would recommend is to simply press a button like F10 or F2 while your computer is booting up. This is going to depend on the specific model of ThinkPad that you have, but after you access the BIOS, you will be able to change options in here. So, once you are inside of the BIOS, look for the security tab at the left. So either use your mouse or the arrow keys and go over to the security category. And inside the security, you will find virtualization. So this is where you will be able to enable or disable it accordingly. So now, once you are inside of the virtualization tab, you have to make sure that these options here, virtualization and VTD feature are enabled. If you don't have an Intel CPU on your Lenovo ThinkPad, then these might differ. For example, it might be referring to AMD, but the basic instructions is that you should enable everything in this page. As long as you have everything in the virtualization category enabled, so set to the on position, you will be able to have it enabled when you boot into Windows. So enter the BIOS by pressing a combination of one of these buttons, either F1, F10, or F2 while your computer is booting. If necessary, read the user manual for your particular model. And now to fin finish off this process, go into the control panel, access programs and features, go into turn Windows features on or off, and in here you will be able to enable Hyper-V. As long as you enable virtualization through the BIOS and then you make sure that Hyper-V and then Hyper-V management tools and Hyper-V platform are enabled, you will be able to use virtualization on your Windows 10 ThinkPad. I hope I was able to help you on how to enable virtualization in Windows 10 Lenovo ThinkPad. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.